because I have a business proposition you might find very interesting. Good. Dad and Lady Jane haven't arrived yet. No, they should be long any minute. Uh, in the meantime, Ned just uh, made an overture of something that could prove very useful. You know, you know what I could care less about, Ashton? I need your help. Lady Jane took it upon herself to ask Bobby to join us for dinner. Lila, I've been thinking a lot about those letters that you wrote. You said to your cousin about your romance with Edward. And you said that Edward wrote to you as well. Oh, Edward was a splendid correspondent. Please tell me that you did not throw those letters away. I, I gave them to my cousin Eleanor for safekeeping with the others. Oh. Is there a possibility that she would still have them? I'm afraid she's been dead for some time. Did she have children? Perhaps they have them. I'm sure they're gone. Regrettably. You'd like to have them. Learn from my mistakes, Felicia. Hold on to all the mementos of your own past. They're more precious than you realize. I'll take that to heart. I'm learning a lot from writing your memoirs. I have just a few more questions for today. Benny? Hi, it's Carly. Yeah, is Jason um, still at the warehouse? Is he on his way home or? Oh, okay, well, I'm gonna catch him there then. Thanks. Thank you, yes, he is a fine looking boy. Oh, and by the way, the Rose Garden looks spectacular. <laughs> What are you doing? Uh, um, I'm, uh, I'm finishing a homework assignment, which if I don't get it done, I'm going to be late for my class. I was wondering if you would like to play hooky tonight. like you could use that. How could you tell? No offense, but you look dirty and thirsty. Yeah, yeah one of the uh, cranes broke down at the warehouse. We wound up loading the coffee manually. Wow. A co-owner willing to get his hands dirty, not to mention his clothes. I used to load crates for a living. But you like owning better. Hmm. Most of the time, but I don't mind helping out. Okay, so let me get this straight. You've been a parking valet, a stevedore, a motorcycle mechanic, and now you're a coffee merchant. Are there any other careers you're hiding? Not at the moment. What about Sonny? You left the books at Kelly's. Elizabeth, I, um, I can't stay, but do you have a minute? Sure. That's it. <clears throat> Actually, the books were just an excuse to check up on you. How are you? I walk, I talk, I eat breakfast in the morning, even though I don't know why. I can't think of anything but Lucky. Nobody expects you to. You know, Lucky was very important to all of us. His absence is like a bottomless pit. Yeah, that's exactly it. I feel like I'm falling, and it's never going to end. But it will. When? When it's time. And in the meantime, you have plenty of people to catch you. People who love you. And who love Lucky. Okay, but you don't understand. I'm sure I don't. Nobody can understand exactly what you're going through. But I do know life goes on. You won't fall forever. I promise. I gotta go. You call me anytime. I'll let myself out.
There were some candles in Lucky's room. They think he fell asleep while they were still burning, and that's how the fire started. Guess what I'm doing right now? Reading your notes? I'm lighting one of your candles. Guess why? Because I gave it to you. Because it's warm, and it smells good, and it lights up a room just like you. Lucky. That's so sweet. Will you light another one for me? General Hospital, brought to you by Excedrin. Excedrin, the headache medicine. For the aches and pains and sore shoulders of life, I keep Tylenol around. I have forever. But headaches are different. For headaches, I use Excedrin. Because Excedrin relieves headaches better than Tylenol. Well, how do I know? Well, they have reports and medical research to prove it. But you know what? I really don't care about all that. I use it. Well, that's how I know it's better. I use it. Excedrin, the headache medicine, also available in gel tabs. This is the one. I was so psyched it came out. My brothers dared me to do it. I didn't think I could keep up. Kodak Max. Now, I've got proof. Film that captures action and takes great pictures in almost any light. Low light, sunlight, action, or still. So, it's our part. <laughs> Kodak Max. It's all you need to know about film. Do you want to hear it again? Okay. Okay. The very beautiful girl woke up, then she helped her mommy make breakfast. They made French toast, syrup, and juice. And then a terrible thing happened. The juice spilled itself all over, and it wasn't anybody's fault, and no one got blamed, right? Right. And she helped her mommy clean it all up. Then, that's the end. Talk will take quick with the Crapper Bounty. Cool, cool, la la, so cool. Cool, la la, refreshing. Cool, la la, so full of the refreshing flavor of life. You know the rain leaves a scent that makes things fresh and new. Introducing Fresh Rain All. It has the stain-lifting power of regular all with a clean, fresh rain scent. That's Fresh Rain A-L-L. -L. It's our biggest sale of the season. Now at Payless, buy one, get the second one half off. My shoes, accessories, everything. So come prepared. You don't want to have to make two trips. Doesn't it feel good? Payless. Wherever introduces non-stick cookware that's safe for use with metal utensils. Thanks to our tough new scratch-resistant non-stick surface. Wherever. For something new is always cooking. Revenge is sweet. <laughs> this is kidnapping. Do you realize that? Really? Yes, really. And payback can be a real witch. Who cares if I die? I'm going to have the satisfaction of knowing that I took you with me. But this lifelong rivalry could come to a bitter end. Don't torch me, Vicky. Make one life to live your great escape. ABC Daytime. Fire started. Yeah, that it was a, it was an accident. It's uh, it's good for Emily. She was really hurt that everybody was blaming her brother. It wasn't fair to accuse the wrong people. That, 
I suppose it should be easier, knowing that no one was to blame, you know. But I, I keep wanting someone to take responsibility for this, you know, so, so I can understand why it happened and make sense of it all. So, um, you've been to the school the last couple of days, huh? Yeah. Graham says I'm pushing myself too hard, but I don't know what else to do. There's, there's always my place that's half furnished. So, uh, why don't you go furniture shopping with uh, me and Emily this weekend? Nicholas, I can't. I understand. It's okay. No. No, you, you don't understand at all. You know what? I would love to have dinner with you tonight, but this is a really important lecture. We're starting on, um, domestic interiors, which is the whole reason that I took the class in the first place. So, I don't know, can I take a rain check? Or... Sure, no problem. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Your little boy's already asleep. I played with him all day outside. Oh, that's great. You know, uh, I'll check in on him as soon as I get back from dropping you off. There's no reason for you to drive me to class. Well, you just got home from work. AJ, it's okay. I just called a cab. It'll be here any second. So, uh... See you later. Mm -hmm. Good luck. With your drawing, you know, design class. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. Okay. Where the hell have you been? EOQ. Is there a problem? There damn well may be. Thanks to the barrage of calls that you've made to the court, they have finally set a date for the custody hearing. That's good. No, we have lost our ace in the hole because Judge Carter couldn't clear his calendar on such short notice. So we have one short week to prove that you and Carly are the perfect parents. There was a cop in here last night. He did everything he could to try to provoke Sonny. Bald, shiny head, extremely bad attitude. That's the one. Mm, that's Taggart. Has a long-standing vendetta against Sonny. Why? I don't know. You'd have to ask Taggart. As long as I can remember, he's been accusing Sonny of everything in the book. Why? Mm -hmm. Don't know, but no proof. No, well, that makes me feel a little better. He got pretty hot under the collar last night. But let me guess. In the end, nothing happened, right? Actually, uh, Miss Scott got rid of... Uh... Super cop for me. Why is it models always look 15? I don't like that. Her? Please. She has another 20 years before she even has to think about wrinkles. <laughs> right, and I'll look 30 years younger overnight. At the Pons Institute, we don't give you hype, we give you results. Our age-defying lotion with these four ingredients is proven to visibly reduce fine lines by up to 77%. Age-defying lotion from the Pons Institute. We guarantee it. No hype, just younger-looking skin. The Healing Garden. It's more than a place. It's a state of mind. The Healing Garden where lavender helps relaxation grow. Green tea lets enlightenment shine. Jasmine makes sensuality blossom. And tangerine makes senses soar. Discover nature's gift of well-being in the healing garden. Holistic fragrances for the mind, body, and spirit. We shall do what we must for a mystic night's happy meal at McDonald's! Yeah! We shall clean it our room! We shall clean we shall obey at our bedtime! Our and we shall not whine if we don't get our way! We shall not? Kids will do almost anything for a Mystic Knight's Happy Meal at McDonald's, and now they can collect eight Mystic Knight's figures, one in every hamburger Happy Meal you buy, still just $1.99. Ah, uh, the sweet, sweet taste of victory. Did somebody say McDonald's? When I come home from work, I just want to play with Sam, not be a disciplinarian. But he's got this security blanket, and I know it's time he gives it up. He drags it everywhere. By the end of the day, I cringe when I think about what's crawling on it. Ew. 
Finally, yeah. there's a detergent that does more than clean. It sanitizes. New Tide with bleach, the only detergent that kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria. As long as he gets rid of it before he goes to the prom. Double your pleasure, double your fun. That's a statement of the great men in double men. The Tampax with the rounded applicator. I have a confession to make. I knew what I wanted in life a long time ago. Love, friendship, <laughs> can't be bothered. Control, money, and power. Now those are the things worth living for. Escape with David, only on All My Children, ABC Daytime. If you're curious about my, my uh difficulties with Lieutenant Tagger. You, you don't have to work Jason. You, you're welcome to ask me. On the contrary, I was concerned about Jason. The lieutenant had also asked about him last night, and I wanted to warn him in case he's in trouble. I appreciate the warning. Anytime. It's nice how she you know, looks out for me. Next time I have trouble with Tagger, maybe I'll call her. What's her method of getting rid of him? She dumped a tray of drinks on him. <laughs> I like that. She likes you. Yeah, I think she does. She's always asking me questions. About what? You. What kind of questions? About whether you'd be all right after Lucky died. About why you want her to stay away from you. And uh, just now she seemed worried that you know, Taggart might, could push it too far. Anyway, here's the shipping manifest for the coffee you moved today. And by the way, the crane broke. I figure something must be wrong by the way you look. Yeah, well, you know what? If we're going to have this meeting with Marino, I should go home and change. If you still want to go through with it. If I can reassure Marino I pose no threat, it'll be better for everybody. AJ, I told you to give this time. Now we have to go into court at a grave disadvantage. The fire that killed that Spencer boy had nothing to do with Jason's criminal pursuits. His coffee business is fully operational, plus which he has that, that court-appointed witch doctor to verify that he is the only man in the world who can make young Michael smile. Worst of all, nobody's taken a shot at him in months. Now, you add to that the fact that he has hired that backstabbing, brilliant, unprincipled attorney, plus the fact that Emily and Bobby, and maybe your mother by now, are probably all now going to line up behind him and, and testify in his behalf. We could end up losing Michael for good. Needless to say, that does not bode well for your prospective future as CEO. There's no need to make threats or panic. Hmm. Do you really think that I would push for an early hearing date if I wasn't 100% confident I can win? You're underestimating me. You see, I'll have Tony Jones' testimony to prove that Jason is an unfit human being, let alone an unfit parent. I have a list of every violent incident that Jason is connected with, including, most recently, the warehouse fire. And the simple truth that Jason is not Michael's biological father, I am. Mm -hmm. Both biological parents are living here in this house, so as long as Carly and I can present a united front, there's no way we can lose. Well, I'm not very confident about this united front. I am. A.J., 
Carly will turn on you in a million. She won't. Well, she if won't. you think she won't. Now, if there are no other fires for me to put out, I have business to take care of. The sooner the better. I know we've met Miss Spencer before, but apparently we weren't paying attention. What's she like? Well, I certainly hope she has more personality than that last insipid... Oh, what was your term for her? Airhead flagpole. <laughs> That's right. That airhead flagpole you dated. At least Miss Spencer speaks English, unlike those belly dancers you brought home that time. Well, let me assure you, Dad, she speaks perfect English. Huh? Admittedly, with a, with a bit of an accent. Oh, I can assure you there's nothing insipid about her. You know, I never thought I'd say this, but my eldest appears quite smitten. Smitten, yes, <laughs> you're, you're smitten. <laughs> you know what, just wipe that grin off your face and behave or I'm gonna smite you. The lot of you. <laughs> I could call Betty. Felicia? <laughs> hey, what are you doing here? Well, I'm honestly not sure, but I need the truth. How do I look? Are you trying to impress someone? Mm, Jerry's parents. Oh, my goodness. You look great. How do you feel? We're coping. Let's not go there or I may start to cry. Right, right, okay. Well, about Jerry's parents, I don't think you have anything to worry about because you've got brains and heart and personality. <laughs> and according to Mac, he never dates anybody with those kind of characteristics. I'm sure you'll be a breath of fresh air. <laughs> Jax is joining you? Are things better there? Yeah, well, there seems to be a bit of a warming trend. I mean, the parents showed up and he didn't ask them to leave. And then this afternoon, his mother called me out of the clear blue sky and asked me to join them for dinner. Hmm? Are you nervous? How nervous do I look? Just the right amount. Besides, you know, you're the best thing that ever happened to Jerry. If anything, his parents should be nervous about meeting you. <laughs> I'll try to remember that. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Good luck. By the way, this has nothing to do with me, so if it goes badly, you can't hold it against me. <laughs> you look beautiful. And, uh, this wasn't my idea either, but I wouldn't have missed it for the world. Lady Jane? Dad? Um, uh, John. This is Bobby Spencer. Be nice. Hello. Charm. <laughs> I agree, and I am so looking forward to getting to know the woman who's stolen our eldest son's heart. I know this isn't what you want to hear, but there is no way, no way, that I can handle a road tour right now, short or small. I have absolutely too much going on at ELQ. Fine, but all I'm saying is that you can't play at Jake's forever. You know, we're going to have to figure out some way to expand your fan base. Well, we'll have to think of Hi. some other way. Hello there. Um, I know I'm interrupting, oh, but please. this is Oh, please. No, real. no. Please interrupt. Otherwise, who knows what this woman could persuade me to do. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and just distract away. I will just jot down exactly where we were. <laughs> when you hired me to write Lila's memoirs, you offered to finance any research that I might need to conduct. Were you serious about that? Very. Oh, good, because I need to track down some of your grandmother's old love letters. There's a possibility they may be in the possession of a distant cousin of hers, a woman named Chloe Morgan. Chloe Morgan, the designer? Yes, that's the one. She's in London right now for the fall showings. She might have the letters that Edward and Lila wrote to each other during their courtship and the letters that Lila wrote to her cousin Eleanor. But you see, there's a little bit of a problem. It's, it's kind of tricky here because every time I call Chloe, well... <sighs> She's not calling me back. She's not returning my calls. Well, she is in the middle of a big show. I know. I think if I don't reach her now, though, I'm never going to reach her. And Lila has been so interested in these letters. I mean, she just, she wants to read them. And I think it's not only going to be beneficial for the book, but it would just be such a wonderful surprise for Lila to present them right. to her. Well, then just go to London and track this lady down. OK, but there's a glitch. Does this look familiar to you? In Lucky's room. Yeah, I bought one for Graham the same time I bought a couple to do something special in Lucky's room. I thought candles made a room look magical. 
I, I like candles, too. I... Laura didn't tell you, did she? Tell me what? About the fire. About how it started. Only that it was an accident. But it wasn't. It was because of the candles, Nicholas. I put them in his room. He lit them because of me. It, it was me. No. I, I get lucky. No, you did not. Let, oh. Liz, Liz, look, look at me. Come here. That's okay. No, you did not. It's okay. Yes, I did. It's okay. I did. Okay. Older eaters, feet are sweeter, fresher, drier, cleaner, neater. Just kick off your shoe, and you'll know it's true. Sweeter. Only odor eaters in soles, sprays, and powders are fortified with genuine Arm & Hammer baking soda. They destroy, devour, and defend against foot odor and wetness. Oh, oh, odor eaters feed us sweeter. Oh, Nestle Treasures, chocolate with a new caramel filling. Oh, these are so tempting. Hmm, kind of like men. These are a lot easier to clean up after. Nestle Treasures, from you to you. Have you asked your doctor about Flonase yet? Flonase nasal spray. Ask your doctor for a trial of Flonase. What are you waiting for? Call 1-800-FLONASE to learn more about Flonase nasal spray. All you want is Flonase. If you think all batteries are pretty much the same, remember this. When Popular Electronics Magazine tested batteries, Energizer smoked the competition. Energizer, advanced formula. Put to the test, it's simply the best. Betty and Pat here with a delicious, easy meal idea. Fold Reynolds Wrap Heavy Duty Foil around vegetable seasonings and two ice cubes. The packet steams in the crisp flavor. And now, clean up. Look for quick and easy packet recipes on the box. General Hospital will continue in a moment here on ABC. You see it only on 10 News. It's leadership using the power of television to help you. Tonight, San Diegans speak out on our biggest problems. A lot of us, me myself included, don't have a vision for the city. What we can do now, how you can help. If you like living in San Diego, you need to watch as we begin an important month saving paradise. Helping you improve your quality of life. Leadership on 10 News Live at 5. It's a never-ending battle between throwing good clothes out or finding better ways to use your closet space, right? Well, it will pay you to invest in making every square inch count. And that's what makes Closets by Design truly different. We engineer every closet around your specific needs and then build it from scratch. You see, Closets by Design is about helping you make the most out of your space. Call now for your free in-home consultation. 682-1010. Seven little numbers that could add up to a big change for you. It's San Diego's 10 Career Center. Call 682-1010 on your touchtone phone to find out about the best jobs at San Diego's top companies. Call 682-1010. It's time for Heilig Meyer's Make Room for Saving. Contestant, what's it cost to turn this room into this room? It's my guess. At least this much. This is the price. I just bought the same look at another store. Uh, right now at Heilig Meyer's, this beautiful group is yours for... Can you believe it? And there are similar savings on rooms throughout the store. I could have saved all that money. <laughs> Only if you make room for savings at Heilig Meyer's. To stay in shape, you work your tail off. But fitness is more than just exercise. It's nutrition, which is why Petco is where the pets go. For Nature's Recipe group-specific formula dog food, buy a 7 or 17-pound bag and get a second bag free with mail-in rebate. Save up to $21.99. We've got the nutrition. Mm. 
The rest is up to you. Petco, where the pets go. Why so many boys are becoming killers. Next door. Now you're gonna tell me not to blame myself, right? Yes. Sweetheart, you weren't even at Lucky's. Yes, but I put the candles in his room. And that night he called to say goodnight to me. He told me he was lighting one of the candles to remind him of me. And I asked him to light another one. <laughs> he must have fallen asleep with the candles going. And that's what started the fire. Even the fire department said so. If it hadn't been for me, it wouldn't have happened. Well, if you're going to blame yourself, then you have to blame Lucky, too. Okay, he's, he's the one who lit the candle, okay? He's, he's the one who left it burning and then fell asleep. But he didn't mean to. So if he didn't mean to, then... Then how did it happen? If he if he wasn't being irresponsible, Elizabeth, then, then it was, it was an what? Accident. It was what? It was an accident. Exactly. It was an accident. No one is to blame, least of all you. Okay? Lucky knows that, and you know that too. So tell me you know it. It was no one's fault. It was what? It was no one's fault. Thanks, Ned. You're welcome. Um, I know that this is a long shot, but it's really the only chance I think I'm going to be able to find these letters. And if I do, it's going to blow Lila away. Not to mention how invaluable it'll be to the book. Good. I'm glad to help. And I really do appreciate all your hard work. Well, I would do it even without pay. After the first couple of chapters, I'm going to ask Lila for her permission for you to proofread it. V's input was very helpful for me for my other book. I'm sort of a grammar freak. I got a scoot. So. Okay. Bye. Bye. Good luck. Bye. Bye. Your grandparents must share an incredible love story. I, uh, I can't wait to read it. Well, V, I didn't realize you were such a uh, big fan of epic romance. <laughs> um, I have my moments. More than a few. Mm -hmm. Felicia? Oh. Hey. Garcia? Never mind. He's right here. Okay. What are you doing I here? I'm so glad to see you. I wanted to speak with you. Has something happened? Uh, um, I'm going to London. Excuse me? I know it's sort of a short notice, but I've got this small window of opportunity and Ned is paying my way. Oh, wait a second. When? When what? Are you leaving? I'm leaving right now. I've just right got off now. the phone with the airline and since I don't have to track you down, I might be able to make the flight. And the girls, they're with Betty right now. And, well, I sort of told them that I might be going out of town, so that'll be all right. Okay, well, when were you going to tell me? I'm telling you right now. Now, don't fight me on this. This is about the book. I'm not fighting you on this. I'm just a few steps behind, okay? Uh, wait a second. What is in London that won't be there tomorrow? Well, I'm trying to track down some letters that are in this possession of this international designer, and I'm hoping that she has them. And if she doesn't, at least maybe she'll know who does have them. I'm going to track her down in London. If I don't find her, then I'm going to track her down to Timbuktu. So, can you handle the girls? I mean, I would do this for you. What am I saying? I would do this for you anyway. I, I got to go, because I don't want to miss the flight. Just give me a big, fat, juicy kiss. <laughs> okay. Or, no, I got, I really right. got to go. I don't well, want to. Wait, do you have your passport? Yeah, I've got it with me. Be careful. Okay, I will. I love you. I love you. Bye. I really do. <laughs> mm. Wait a second. What is the name of this woman that you're going to see? Chloe Morgan. M-O-R-G-A-N. Morgan. And the sandstorm blew in. It was fierce. And... If Jackson and Alexis hadn't found that cave, I'm not sure they would have made it. But you did, and I assure you, I thank God every second that both of you are safe. But I don't see what any of this has to do with how Jerry met Bobby. Well, actually, the first thing I met was his coat. It fell on the ground in front of me as he was climbing out the window of his hotel. And you didn't run screaming in the opposite direction? <laughs> Bobby's a woman of rare courage. Or questionable judgment. Oh, no, on the contrary. I assure you, I have very good judgment where your oldest son is concerned. I, I liked him from the start. Didn't act like it. <clears throat> we were interrupted yesterday before you got a chance to answer my question about that fire that killed Lucky Spencer. I told you, really, it was an accident. 
Is that is that how you live with yourself? You you tell yourself the damage you do is is accidental? I don't give a damn what the Osmer report said. Lucky Spencer died because he lived in a building that belonged to your apartment. Now that kid's blood, his parents' pain, and his little girlfriend's tears are on your head. You know what? You can go ahead and play all these games you want. Pursue your vendetta, jerk me around, but you will not exploit Lucky Spencer's death. You spill that tray on me, I'm taking you in for assault. And you do not come in to my club and threaten my waitresses. Now you leave now, or I will call Scorpio, and you will lose your badge. Wow. I didn't realize you were so protective over your employees. It's too bad you weren't that protective of Lucky Spencer. You know, I respected that kid. He had guts and honesty. Where he screwed up was in making the mistake of trusting you and Morgan. Oh, yeah, the good criminals. Doing the kid a favor, keep him off the street. Yeah, that's some help. Death by inferno. I wonder who died worse, the Spencer kid. Excuse me? I'd like to get the proper spelling of your name so I can be accurate when I file a harassment complaint. Today, we're going to discuss molars! Tooth care has never been this exciting. Until now, new Trident Advantage, clinically proven to help whiten teeth and reduce unsightly plaque. New Trident Advantage. Imagine a day outdoors without the runny nose. Imagine a day indoors without the itchy eyes. Make it happen with Benadryl, the histamine blocker. Get outdoor allergy relief and indoor allergy relief. Benadryl. Question, how do dermatologists visibly reduce the appearance of wrinkles, fine lines, and age spots caused by the sun? The same way you can, with Neutrogena Anti-Wrinkle Cream. It contains retinol, the purest form of vitamin A, to work deeper within the skin surface, reducing the appearance of wrinkles and fine lines. And SPF 15 to help prevent future sun damage. Get younger, healthier looking skin within two weeks. With the retinol cream recommended number one by dermatologists. Neutrogena Healthy Skin Anti-Wrinkle Cream. Grand cinnamon rolls from Pillsbury. Get ready. The most enormous, ooey, gooey, luscious. Should we wake the others? Let them sleep. Grand cinnamon rolls. They're not just big, they're grand. You wouldn't believe what some people use to improve their hair's condition when all you really need is a blow dryer and heat activated thermosilk to make your hair healthier. Thermosilk, where there's heat, there's healthy hair. I'm Roger Saudi from Post Cereals. I grew up on cereal. Followed the funnies, sent for that sheriff's badge. It was the way to start the day. Now that I've grown up, my cereal is post shredded wheat. Simple, honest, pure, and so wholesome, the feeling you're off on the right foot stays with you all day long. Post shredded wheat. It's starting the day with cereal and doing it right. What if your baby's skin was healthier here? Would he smile more here? What if his diaper let healthy air through here and locked away irritating wetness there? Would he laugh louder here? He might, if his diaper is Huggies Ultra Trim. No diaper protects baby's skin from irritating wetness like Huggies, and that's important for healthy skin. So he may have a little more fun in everything he does. Huggies Ultra Trim, because healthy skin means happy babies. There's a man. He looks just like me. A psychotic killer has taken Martin Stillwater's family and taken over his life. Xerox, Mr. Stillwater. Now a father has to risk all. He knows where I am. Before he's eliminated. <laughs> Stephen Baldwin and Oscar winner James Coburn. Stay away! The conclusion of Dean Koontz's Mr. Murder, ABC Tonight. We'd like to invite you to the opening of our new club, Sounds of Salsa. Latin great Tito Nieves will perform opening night. Grand opening Wednesday, May 5th, All My Children, ABC Daytime. 
You may want to reconsider threatening an officer, miss. You may want to reconsider harassing an innocent citizen two days in a row. Me, Claude, the other girls, and every one of the customers are witnesses. You confronted Mr. Corinthos on groundless accusations. You've badgered him about a fire that the police have already declared accidental. You're persecuting him, and you think you can get away with it because you carry a badge. You may be a cop, but you're the worst kind of bully. You go near Mr. Corinthos one more time, I and the rest of Luke's staff will go down to the PCPD and we'll make sure you lose your job. You're obviously new in town. Mr. Corinthos is a racketeer. The people that surround him wind up on sedatives and straight jackets or dead. Now, I am sick and tired of going to the morgue and putting names in his file. Now, if you are smart, you will avoid him. If you're not, I will consider you one of his accomplices. And that could buy you more trouble than you are looking for. You just made a major mistake. <clears throat> His vendetta with me is my business. I don't want you involved. Fine. Remind me not to defend you next time. I mean, you can you can you can challenge me in any other way you want to, but my business has nothing to do with you. I don't want you to interfere or get involved in any way. That's just who I am. You understand? I understand. Good. I mean, you know, I mean, antagonizing Taggart, you're only asking for trouble. What, what were you thinking following him out here? Well, Mum and Dad have been safely returned to their suite to pack for the flight home. Bobby's just checking on Lucas. Is it just me, or was that the most excruciating dinner we've ever sat through? You should be used to our parents by now. Remember, what goes around comes around. And someday, you're going to find yourself in my shoes with Dad and Lady Jane giving some poor woman the once-over. And I plan to enjoy every minute of it. Ladies and gentlemen, we've been cleared for takeoff. Please remain seated with your seatbelts fastened. Okay, Chloe Morgan, let's find out a little bit about you. If you drink coffee or smoke, Plus White challenges you to unstain your teeth. They could be this stain. But Plus White gets rid of smoking and coffee stains fast. After one brushing, see the difference? My stains are gone. Get the Plus with Plus White. You're why I bake a Dunkin' Heinz cake. You don't need a special occasion to bake a cake as moist as Dunkin' Heinz. Just a special person. You're why I bake a Dunkin' Heinz cake. You're why I bake. Just when you thought you left it all behind, your day followed you home. Escape. With soft soap relaxing body wash, let the calming scent of fresh lavender and soothing chamomile set you free. Lose yourself in rich moisture beads. Skin is soft, smooth. Escape with soft soap body wash. More than just clean. Don't be a drip. I'm not. I color with the cream that doesn't drip. Excellence cream from L'Oreal, the non-drip color cream. 
Of course, it protects, always has. But now, excellence is even better with a Ceramide and Protein formula to revitalize your hair. For rich color, incredible body, more oomph. And does it ever cover grays? Not that I ever had any. Excellence Cream from L'Oreal. Because I'm worth it. You're on Love Matters. When love matters, I'm here to help. Dave? Yeah, I'm having this problem with my Ooh. girlfriend. It's kind of involved. Diarrhea. Get it, and you want it gone. You're a really good listener, you know? He needs really Emodium AD. Emodium Advanced. It's even better. Only Emodium Advanced relieves diarrhea plus cramps and bloating by combining two medicines. And it's even faster than Emodium AD. So was I right to invite my mom along in my honeymoon? Oh, Dave, absolutely. Emodium Advanced. Faster relief you can count on. It's really dark. Shh, here she comes. Look at the stains on those colored clothes. Just like the whites you did. Can you get those stains and still leave those colors bright? I can, or my name's not Clorox 2. Clorox 2 Color Safe Bleach. It does what Clorox Bleach does on whites, but it's buffered to do it safely on colors. Do your colors always look so good? Always. Except in the dark. Clorox 2. The Clorox Bleach for colors. Loved the idea, but it made me nervous. Well, me too, and I wasn't taking any chances, so I tested it back here first. You don't have to take chances. Febreze cleans odors out of fabrics, safely. And well, when it didn't stain my sofa, <laughs> I went a little crazy with it. Crazy would be not using Febreze. Febreze? Found it in the laundry aisle. Thanks. And it's even safe on this. So don't hold back. It's a world full of fabric out there. Febreze cleans bad smells out of fabrics for good. Friday from ABC News, a celebration of this past century's most intriguing, important, and influential women. Oprah Winfrey, Bette Midler, Jane Fonda, Rosie I'm O'Donnell, sorry. and others help Barbara Walters present the most spectacular women of this century. 100 years of great women, Friday at a special time, 9.30, 8.30 Central. So, did you find Carly? I wasn't looking for her. She's at her design class, and I had other details to take care of. No detail is more important than ensuring that young lady's cooperation. I know. I hope you do. shouldn't be here. Why? I covered myself. I told AJ that I was going to a really important design lecture, and I actually did. I showed up for about 10 minutes, and I slipped out the back. Nobody knows I'm here, except you and me. I can't stop thinking about you, Jason, and about us. Carly, don't. Why? Come on. I want to be with you. And I know you want to be with me. I have a problem with cops who use their badge as an excuse to push people around. Still, antagonizing Taggart is only asking for trouble, and it's trouble you don't need. I told you, I like to live dangerously. Suit yourself. The, uh, the model, she's never been on tour before, so <clears throat> I'm going to go along with her just to smooth out any rough edges. But it's, uh, it's all starting to, you know, take shape and, and, and come together now that I've set the Chicago dates. So am I, am I boring you to tears yet? <laughs> <laughs> no. Actually, it's pretty interesting. And it helps me to concentrate on something else. All right. I'll go with you and M shopping this weekend. Good. You know, I know you're doing this just for me. 
But you have to promise me one thing, that you will veto anything I pick out that's atrocious or completely not you, even remotely not you. Because <laughs> I don't want you ending up with a house full of furniture you don't like just because you're trying to make me happy. I've, I'm not just trying to make you happy. I mean, the way, the way I see it is, if I don't get my place decorated, I'm going to walk through the door one day and Catherine's going to have my place looking like a, a museum showroom, okay? So I, I actually <laughs> need your help with, with all of this. I need yours, too. I'll, I'll get it. Hi. Hi. I have a package for Elizabeth Weber. Oh. Okay. Sign right there. Turn your work after they've evaluated it. Like his portraits in there. You don't have to open it. Would you open it for me? Okay. So why are you over here? just like you. Lucky hated posing for me. He only did it because he loved me. I apologize for keeping you waiting. Don't you mean for keeping me a prisoner? I've been somewhat remiss in my duties as a host. So, please allow me to introduce myself. Say ça fait ça. Stay tuned for scenes from the next General Hospital. Caress, a beautiful fragrance that seduces your senses. Yeah, yeah. You won't believe what a Caress shower can do. When you combine Reese's Peanut Butter Cups and Crispy Wafers, the combination is irresistible. Reese Sticks, the crisp you can't resist. Get the stick, Rascal! It's gotta be the puppy chow. We reformulated new Purina puppy chow to help provide the building blocks growing puppies need for a long, strong, and exceptional life. Purina puppy chow brand. A model with a womanly body? That made me a first. Here's another. New Color Stay Compact Makeup. Looks this natural, feels this comfortable, and won't rub off. New Color Stay Compact Makeup. Revlon! Johnson's Baby Shampoo Moisturizing Formula is causing a minor household crisis. You are not the baby. Yeah, but it makes my hair feel baby soft. It moisturizes while gently cleansing, so the entire family's using it. You are not the baby. It's not just for babies. It says so right here. It's as gentle to the eyes as pure water, but there's no shampoo like it. Where's that honey shampoo? Johnson's Baby Shampoo Moisturizing Formula with honey and vitamin E. I'm the baby. <laughs> From Johnson's. The revolutionary Braun Oral B 3D. It's the only plaque remover designed to pulsate deep between teeth. It pulsates to loosen plaque and oscillates to sweep it away. It cleans deep, better than an ordinary toothbrush. The Braun Oral B 3D. It pulsates deep to clean better. 
Now is the perfect time to change the way you brush because every Braun Oral-B plaque remover is specially priced. Smart. It's the magic word during Kenmore days. Our exclusive Kenmore appliance event and quite a clever time to buy. Add free delivery or 0% finance charge on all Kenmore appliances over $3.99 and poof, you could buy that shiny new dishwasher. Kenmore Days. Your new kitchen is now on sale. Only at Sears. Smart. Stylish. Simple. In a word, Kenmore. America's best-selling appliance brand. Because we need to fantasize about things that we really want. Maybe because your head wants to. Because our mind is like a puzzle. If you didn't dream, you'd just sleep and you wouldn't think of anything. But your super ego and your ego at night when they rest a little... Dreams. Ooh. On the next General Hospital. Cesar. Faison. Your mother tried to kill me and make it look like an accident. Something on your mind? Yeah, the other night. Oh, you're right. You are dangerous. Tonight, following America's Funniest Home Videos, a stranger took his family, and Stephen Baldwin will risk all to get them back. On the conclusion of ABC's world premiere event, Dean Koontz's Mr. Murder, ABC Tonight. On May 23rd, pleasure becomes power. Cleopatra.